एपीके आई कॉमिक्स प्रेजेंट्स छोटे रोबोट एपिसोड फाइव गुड टच बैड टच विथ धनुषन प्रदीबा प्रदीबा इज सैड छोटे एंड धनुष इंक्वायर हर वॉट हैपन्ड यू लुक वेरी अपसेट डोंट वरी वी विल ट्राई हेल्पिंग यू येस वी विल श्योरली हेल्प यू माई फ्रेंड सीमा वॉज सैड सो आई टू एम फीलिंग सैड एज आई कैन नॉट अंडरस्टैंड वॉट डू यू मीन सीमा हैड विजिटेड हर अंकल्स हाउस ऑन सैटरडे There a man came and hugged her and gave her chocolates. She loves chocolates but still she started crying. Maybe he was a stranger so she would have got scared. Mother walks in and hears the conversation. Just relax. It's okay to not like someone touching you. What do you mean? I like and feel safe when you or dad hug me. True, but there are times when we don't like someone even to touching us. Pradeepa and Dhanush look confused. Mother wants to say that there is something like good touch and bad touch. Right mother, right chote. Children should understand the difference so that they are safe. How will I know who is good and who is bad? You should always be careful and alert when you go out. Parents always tell children not to talk to strangers. Children should understand why they are telling. Never go to public places alone or without telling your parents. And you should always go with one known adult. but how can we tell if the adult with whom we are going is a good person or not and there are few known adults but we might not know them well that is why we insist to not go with anyone except close family members does that mean we should always be with some adult till we grow up not really as you grow up you should learn to identify the difference between good and bad and anything that makes you feel uncomfortable you should come and tell your parents but i hug you and dad often and i don't feel bad about it yes but you have to understand that apart from your parents no one else should touch you or hug you without your consent but i still haven't understood why seema was so upset by someone hugging her we should not allow anyone to touch us without our consent also you should go close and hug only to those relatives with whom you trust and feel safe pradeepa and dhanush are understanding a bit and not their head If someone gives you a bad touch you should inform your parents never keep it as a secret remember one very important thing you should not allow anyone to touch your lips mouth face neck and shoulder stomach legs buttocks thighs hands chest or between your legs oh so girls should be careful right no even boys have to be careful boys too should learn to protect themselves now i am understanding why my friend was sad Don't you think mother we should go and inform her mother maybe she can make Seema feel better yes we will go now and talk to her mother don't worry Seema will be fine soon then why did Seema not go and tell her mother also remember children anything happens you should always come and inform your parents one very important point children never assume that your parents will scold you learn to trust them that might be because the person who hugged her was no to her uncle and she would have thought her mother might get upset with her to feel that way but what when we visit a doctor he too touches us a doctor cannot diagnose without touching you but they will never touch you without your parents being around remember if you feel threatened by anyone and your parents are not around immediately scream for help one basic technique children if you are in a situation like this never panic have presence of mind push the person who is coming to touch you without your permission then as your mother said scream out for help be brave come let's go to seema's house and talk to her mother pradeepa and dhanush are happy that they have learned something new and plan to share this information with all their friends seema's mother and pradeepa's mother come down pradeepa thank you for bringing it to my notice that something is troubling seema Her father and I were worried because after returning from her uncle's house she was dull and was neither talking nor eating. How can I be happy when my friend is sad? I have also realized that I should not be scared. It was not my mistake and I should have shared my feelings with my parents. Pradeepa and Seema, see all our friends have come. Friends, we are here to learn and understand the difference between good touch and bad touch. Children, you all need to learn to be brave. Never go to any place without your parents permission and it is very important for all of you to learn self defense. What is self defense? It means a way to protect ourselves from any attack like karate wherein we are taught to defend ourselves when in trouble. But remember it should not be misused. You should use these self defense techniques only for saving yourself or others. I will ask my karate master to teach all my friends basic techniques for self defense.
How many of you would like to join? We all want to learn. If someone gives you a bad touch, you should inform your parents. Never keep it as a secret.